Oh, hi. I wasn't expecting you. This is Open Possum. And I would like to take you through a very detailed tour of our setup and what we do to make the awesome songs that you love. Our first point of call is this pad. You press buttons and sounds happen. So this pad is um, connected wirelessly that's without the use of wires for anyone who doesn't know to this computer which is running Ableton Live which is probably our most used um, songwriting program and also it is connected to this the Denon 91130 Omega Delta the Numark IDJ 99133 Charlie Horse Scumbag and the 7. It also comes with probably our most proud feature here at Open Possum, a TV control. You simply just press this and it doesn't light up at all and the TV starts. It's pretty sweet. Arcade. That's Lee Duffus for anyone else who doesn't like the name Arcade. Um, okay, what we've got here is uh, the Yamaha keyboard. Okay? Not a synthesizer. It is an electronic keyboard. But it sounds pretty awesome nonetheless. <laughs> If I press it softly, it plays it softly. If I press it hard, it plays it hard. It also has pitch bend control. Oh, bends it up to the next tone. It's the same note. So, what's it like working at Open Possum? At Open Possum? Yes. Um, well, we're at Catholic Thunder Studios. But whatever. It's it's not very productive. We get maybe one song a month completed. Yeah, we've we spent all our budget money on pizza and Pepsi. Uh, working at Open Possum, I feel personally that it's great. The the food's good. I cook most of it myself because I'm a brilliant chef. I have my own cooking channel. Watch it. And um, yeah, I don't know. It's really good to work with the hardware, at least. My partner is not so great. But you know. Um, on a good day, I reckon we'd get about three songs done in maybe a few hours. So I don't mean to brag, but that's pretty good progress. <laughs> Just, just saying. And, um, yeah. So, uh, what do you intend to do with the sales money that you make from selling pun intended? Well, I'm sure that the way things have gone in the past, we'll just spend it all on pizza and Pepsi. Oh. What's your favourite part of the music making process? My favourite part of the music making process... Uh, that's a tough one actually. Um, there's just so much to enjoy. If I had to put my finger on one particular step, I would probably choose the recording? Maybe. It's a dispute between recording and then actually putting the finishing touches on the music because just there's there's this feeling of completion that you get I could listen to a song like a thousand times over and over again just get the tune in my head 
because it's just a good feeling. And then when we record it, it's, it's a brilliant, bleh, bleh, I believe. Thanks. So, um, who would you say your, your biggest inspirations in the songwriting world would be? Um, I don't know, I like, I like a bit of the, you know, Eiffel 65 and, uh, you know, the 90s bubblegum stuff, but I'd say my biggest inspiration has to be, um, maybe Kesha. Kesha. She's, she's been great to us. Really great. So what's your favourite Open Possum track? Um, right, I don't know. I'd have to say right now that my favourite Open... Do you want these milkshakes or what? Or do I just throw them out? Here on the netbook we have um, loaded up FL Studio by Image Line. It's a beat making program. Uh, this is a little program called D Blue Glitch. Right? It's a sampling program. And we've basically we just filled it with the modulator and the bit crusher. And I want to say let me just turn up the Seed on the Floxinox and I Lifolificator um, and turn the D click down to zero. This is basically what I do all day. Um, it can be really monotonous, to be frank with you. Uh, okay, just like, just before I do this, I'd just like to give a shout out to my hair, which is now red, and my mustache, which is now growing back, but was gone. Right, now here, this is what we call R2-D2. It's a Samsung media mic, not Samsung, that's like a, what is that, TV, I don't know, but this is a microphone, it's got legs, that fold, it's pretty handy. You think, but it's patented, so don't steal it. Um, do a volume knob. It's blue light. That's cool. A little LED tells you that it's on. I suppose. Um, it's really shiny. We use it to record. It's much better than our Guitar Hero mic that we used to use. Then that's about it for us, I think. Um, it's been great having you here. I hope you buy the album. It's fifteen dollars. So, you know, head down to your local Open Possum store to grab a copy, and see you next time.